So, so, this is Sims Playhouse presents how to delete your origin cache files. This is your girl Janae, and I'm going to take you through a brief tutorial on how to delete your origin cache files. Before we get any further, take a moment, like that button down there, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and turn on your notifications so you can find out when I hit upload another video. Ah, it's one of those days. Okay, so a lot of times we find ourselves in problems with our game not loading properly. We can't get Origin to open up, and this is a speci this is specifically when Origin is at fault. A lot of times our game is more or less okay, but we just can't get Origin to act right. So in the past, what we would do is uninstall the game, uninstall Origin, you know, scan our computers, reboot the computers, and then reinstall everything and it takes hours to reinstall your base game and all the stuff packs and everything else that you have so first things first what i like to do every single time i go through this, this situation the first thing i do is go into my sims game and i remove the mods folder because people i have a lot of mods and custom content that i can't afford to lose i take my mods folder my recorded videos my my saves my screenshots and my tray folders and i put them on my desktop for safekeeping okay so right now we're going to just custom music custom mods that's uh, mods recording saves tray and screenshots now i don't have custom music in my game right now so i don't have to do this to move the cost the custom music but i will just put them on my desktop and this is literally just for safekeeping so that you do not lose anything that is absolutely important to you with your game all right the next thing we're going to do really quickly we're going to go up into our uh 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 Lord have mercy, what is this called? I've lost my memory. You're going to go up here into the view tab and you're going to go and make sure that your hidden items is checked so that it will show all hidden items because you need to be able to see these hidden items. Okay, so we're going to go into this PC, your operating system, your C drive or wherever your game is actually installed on your system and you're going to go to your program data and you will find <clears throat> sorry your origin folder in here and you're going to go in here and you will delete everything in here except the local content file so we're just going to hit one two three we're just going to hit all of these we're not hitting the local content okay let's get back to home tab here and hit delete we're going to delete those documents those folders are there and then we're going to delete all these underneath it it's very important that you do not delete your local content now a lot of times this may come up and it might try to give you a problem as to why it won't delete it you can just open it up and go in manually delete everything in there as much as it will let you and skip the one that it won't let you delete that's okay but you cleared this particular <coughs> uh sorry this particular bit of cash in here so now we're going to back out now and we're going to go to your users and you go to the, the, pro, the profile that you have your game installed on okay the one that you have your game installed on and you're going to go into your app data that's one of those hidden files that you normally will not see you go into your app data and go into the local folder and you find your origin folder and you want to delete that folder when you're finished with that you simply back out one in app data and you go down to roaming and you find the origin folder there as well and hit delete and that is pretty much it you have just deleted your origin cache now you will simply Go back to your origin game, start it, and you should have a game that's running smoothly. It will reinstall all of your applications, all of your 
your base games everything will, will be there installed in place for you so now i have origin loaded up really quickly and this i'm just literally just gonna hit start hit play i did not add back my custom content and my mods as yet but it will be back up really shortly And you can see my game is loading up and this will load up really fast because of the fact that I do not in fact have any of my custom content or my mods in the game so this is gonna load up in a couple of seconds maybe a minute or so but the game will load up really quickly as you can see it's opened up I have no saves no you know I, I literally have nothing this is a completely vanilla game absolutely nothing in here my entire gallery everything is going to be completely empty but then all i have to do is quit out of here really quickly and i can go ahead and add my mods and those folders back into my game and my game should run a lot smoother than it did before again if you have any questions please feel free to comment in the, in the comment section leave your questions for me i'll be glad to answer them uh like the video and subscribe hit the notification so you can be notified the next time i upload another video for you guys to look at again thank you for watching thank you for joining us dad dad If you like what you see, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Dag dag!